morning I woke up in the vortex and I felt satisfied. This morning I woke up in the vortex and I felt eager. I love waking up in the vortex and feeling eager. I like a feeling of eagerness. I like a feeling of satisfaction. Today I looked at someone and I felt such appreciation for them. I really enjoy feeling love. When I'm in the vortex, I feel satisfied. I like being in the vortex because things feel clearer. When I'm in the vortex, I feel clear-minded. I feel sort of elated. When I'm in the vortex, it's like my heart is singing. When I'm in the vortex, I feel satisfied. When I'm in the vortex, I feel ease. When I'm in the vortex, I feel sort of energized. When I'm in the vortex, I feel like doing stuff. When I'm in the vortex, my body feels good. When I'm in the vortex, I like taking a walk. When I'm in a vortex, my dog licks my face. When I'm in the, when I'm in the vortex, I just feel, I feel good. When I'm in the vortex, food tastes good. I like being in the vortex. When I'm in the vortex, I know my power. When I'm in the vortex, I feel more sure about things. When I'm in the vortex, I know my own goodness. When I'm in the vortex, I, I just feel good about me. When I'm in the vortex, I trust that things are going to go well. When I'm in the vortex, I feel optimistic about things. When I'm in the vortex, I feel ready for more. When I'm in the vortex, I feel like I can do about anything. When I'm in the vortex, I feel more sure of myself. When I'm in the vortex, I let people off the hook more. When I'm in the vortex, good things happen to me. When I'm in the vortex, I can feel I'm in the flow. When I'm in the vortex, I feel ease about life. When I'm in the vortex, it's like the universe cooperates with me. When I'm in the vortex, I know my goodness because it sort of surrounds me. When I'm in the vortex, the universe gives me evidence that I'm in there, not as a reward, but as a consequence of my alignment with who I am. When I'm in the vortex, the indicators that surround me in conversations and in my own emotions and in outright manifestations, they represent my being in the vortex. When I'm in the vortex, I like being in the vortex. When I'm in the vortex, it seems easy to stay there. When I'm in the vortex, I want never to leave. When I'm in the vortex, it feels natural and normal to contemplate creation. When I'm in the vortex, I feel unlimited. When I'm in the vortex, I'm glad for all I've lived and what I've put in the vortex. When I'm in the vortex, I have clear view of what I've put here. When I'm in the vortex, I feel satisfied about my life. When I'm in the vortex, I feel ready to go and do more. When I'm in the vortex, I love my life. When I'm in the vortex, I love me. When I'm in the vortex, I love the people who help me put stuff in the vortex. When I'm in the vortex, I do better financially. When I'm in the vortex, I leverage time and effort in a better way. When I'm in the vortex, things line up for me better. When I'm in the vortex, it's like time slows down and satisfaction speeds up. When I'm in the vortex, I savor more. When I'm in the vortex, I sit and contemplate and my thoughts are pleasing to me. When I'm in the vortex, sometimes I just ponder just for the satisfaction of pondering that thought. When I'm in the vortex, it's like I only have access to the memories that are pleasing and to the current environment that is pleasing. When I'm in the vortex, I can feel that the whole of me is integrated with the source that is me. And I know my power and my well-being. And I sort of want to shout it from the rooftops. I want to say, bring it on world because I can handle it. I want to say, whatever it is, I'm up for it. I want to say, I signed on for sifting through contrast and I'm good at it. I want to say, I know how to direct my thought. I've trained myself there. I'm really good at what I do. I'm a powerful focuser. I have been for a long time. I love to focus upon good feeling thoughts. I love to focus myself into alignment. I love being in the vortex. I love who I am. I love this experience of creation. I love the source energy part of me and lining up with it. I love the fact that I was willing to depart from source a bit to stir things up. I love how much I stirred up. I love how much I put there. I love the power of my desire. I think it's my time, Abraham. I think it's time. I think I've paid the price of contrast and I think I've put plenty there. And I think I'm willing to let go 
of the resistant aspects of my life experience I think I'm ready to just start trusting to start trusting the laws of the universe and really putting this vortex thing to a test I'm gonna stop struggling and striving and I'm gonna let my undivided attention go toward whatever it takes for me to get into the vortex I love you Abraham and what you represent I love the clarity that you have brought to me and the understanding that I have garnered for myself I'm appreciative of all of the people who have sort of prodded me into expansion and I am eager to come into full and constant alignment with that expansion I acknowledge Abraham that I've spent time outside the vortex and I'm happy that you remind me that everybody does I acknowledge Abraham that I know the difference between alignment and not you have given me many processes that have helped me know and I have found myself feeling relief on occasion but not really very often I've been more in the vortex in this last five minutes that you've been rampaging to me once I finally stopped struggling and allowed you to have your way with me I've been longer in the vortex just now than I have been for a very long time and I'm beginning to feel the soothing of being in that vortex I am beginning to understand the love that you have for me and the love that source has for me and I'm beginning to get that taste in my mouth of victory in terms of the things that I've been asking for I want to announce to everyone listening to the entire universe who is vibrationally out there somewhere picking up on pieces of this in some way I want to announce to everything and everyone who exists that I here now proclaim my determination to release my resistance once and for all I give up 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 my control of the uncontrollable I give up my determination to make things better for others I give up my attention to things that bother me I give up my trying so hard I give up my struggle I give up my confounding confusion I give up my excuse for negative emotion I'm giving up my excuses I'm giving up my statements of what is not working I'm giving up I'm yielding Abraham I'm yielding to the truths and to the laws that you've been speaking to me what I've been doing has been halfway even though I've been wanting to do it all the way I've given it more effort than anybody that you know in all of the people that you've been teaching I've given it more effort and in my struggle from outside the vortex I have not managed what I want and so now I see the light a little bit Abraham I see why you began depicting a vortex as a vivid reality with a line that I could cross I'm beginning to understand that your request for me to get into the vortex is the only thing that will ever work for me I have to let go of all of those pieces because in my interaction with all of those pieces I just hold myself out and hold myself out and hold myself out and my frustration is huge when I hold myself out as I'm trying to explain but I'm only out because of this reality and this reality and this reality Abraham I now understand that you were never trying to say to me that those realities didn't exist you were only trying to say to me that those realities do not serve me when I focus upon them you've convinced me Abraham that it's time for me to tell the story of my empowerment it's time for me to tell the story of my worthiness it's time for me to tout the benefit of my knowledge of law of attraction it's time for me to understand the vortex whatever in the hell it is and get into it it's time for me to begin finding my way to begin feeling my way I'm gonna feel my way into the vortex and I'm gonna stop thinking my way into the vortex I'm gonna feel my way in it feels good here it feels like clarity it feels like power it feels like love it feels like solution it feels like answers to questions it feels like something that I've been looking for for a very long time Abraham clearly you're in the vortex you have demonstrated that you're in the vortex your words reflect that you're in the vortex I will not admit that I am in the vortex but I like the sound of the way you sounded from inside the vortex and it will be my eternal quest to give up whatever I have to give up in order to spend more of my time in the vortex it's my time it's my time to reap the benefit of the work I've done and now I'm going to turn my undivided attention toward getting into the vortex as best I can I want to be a cooperative component 
I want to be a vibrational match to all that I've been asking for. I want to be a cooperative component. I want to be a vibrational match to the source within me, to the culmination of all that I have become. I want to fulfill my reason for being here. I want to have step one moments. I want to acknowledge that source is having step two moments. I want to be aware of the difference between a step one and a step three vibration. I want to acknowledge that it's all right for me to have step one moments. I want to know that it's okay to be out of the vortex. I want to make peace with where I am. I want to look for the positive aspects wherever I am. I want to make lists of things that feel better than other things. I want to make lists of things that feel good until I've increasingly improved lists. I want to activate within myself thoughts about things that feel good. I want the dominant thoughts that I think to be inside the vortex kind of thoughts. I want the majority of the beliefs that I hold to match the beliefs that source holds. I want to relieve myself of the flawed premises that I picked up along the physical trail. I want to let all other people live as they want to live. I no longer want to use anyone or anything as my excuse to be outside the vortex. I'm an in the vortex person. I'm someone who wants to be in the vortex, but I'm still physically focused and while my source is always in the vortex, I'm willing to come out and play and put more good stuff in but now I understand the relationship I understand what emotions are I understand the vibrational frequencies between who I am and who I'm being I love the emotional guidance system that is within me I love feeling my way into the vortex I love knowing the well-being of the vortex I love knowing that all truly is well with me I love feeling the worthiness of my beingness and the prosperity of my being and the vitality of my being and the clarity of my being and the knowing of Abundance is the feeling of well-being. It's the feeling of good attracting. It's the feeling of good creation. It's the feeling of worthiness. It's the feeling of being in the right place. It's the feeling of being blessed. It's the feeling of being fortunate. It's the feeling of being in the right place at the right time. It's the, it's not just a, my point of attraction. We're speaking from you. My point of attraction isn't just about money flowing. It's about ideas flowing and people flowing. And when people and ideas and money flow together it's so exhilarating to be able to merge all of those things together of people and places and ideas and the and the means to accomplish it it's ease it's fun it's full it's who I am I have the leverage of the universe supporting me the energy that creates worlds is flowing to me and through me I feel invincible and and complete and sure and eager I feel eager about you see so you see how it gets going before you know it you just you're just on top of the world and nothing it and the financial experience in this moment is irrelevant to this equation because your point of attraction has been enhanced and you are rich with a vibrational offering that just brings this and this and this and this and this and besides the reason that you want any of that anyway is for the feeling of it and once you accomplish the feeling of it now you're there where the details have to fill in it is law it must happen it has to happen it can't not happen once you achieve that grid everyone that you know at no matter how they got there has that going on if if they're in and do you know anyone who is finding financial balance but doesn't have the other balance of course you do in other words the the, the more you work on these grids and the more they line up then the more you'll feel good in all moments regarding all things this is what it's all about humans come often they bang around they can hardly wait to croak so that they can receive their reward and we say hey the reward is the physical manifestation and it is as delicious as you allow it to be you get to define your reward and you get to assign your reward and you get to prepare yourself for the receiving of your reward and you get to interpret your reward and you get to experience your reward in other words it's all you it's all you with the constant deliberate attention and love and respect of that which is us